Um, actually, never mind. They are busy. <laughs> never mind. Uh, Jesus. Sorry about that. They are busy. And I found a problem at the same time. Actually, I stopped it. I was planning to call. Oof. Talk about embarrassment. I believe in ad will run, no? Okay. So we are back online. Really sorry about that. I called them and they were busy. Yeah. So the Arabic language actually is not supported in this idiot, the monogram in XNA, and not supportedly natively in a lot of councils. They do some kind of tricks like printing the whole um, image or something to make it work. So actually I made my own encryption decryption system to make a new Arabic language actually, my own Arabic. So let's see. So you see the decryption in here, or encryption I mean. We need to print it instead of the numbers to print our own thing. So let's go to the draw function and make it so and do something like if the name of the current language is Arabic like not in here like here Where is it? And else, actually it should be else first, but oh well, no problem. So this one is from dialogue and I is actually is the game core selected language so let's do nothing if it is Arabic and if it is not we print the normal letters so you see we do nothing and I'm not sure why this is only main not main menu I will take a look on it later uh, this will be a little bit pain in the butt a little bit pain in the butt so we have the Arabic from the company that I asked them to do. We are not going to use this one. We are going to use my old one actually. And my old one, the size is, if I'm not mistaken, is 10 by 11. So the encryption, I took the value in the ASCII or the, 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 the Unicode and Gave them the value of the order of my letters in here. And I tried my best to, to make them organized. The problem is Arabic language, each letter have four shapes. But in the Unicode, it only memorized all the shapes as one language. Or one letter, I mean. So this one have only one value, 1570 something. But <laughs> when you print them in non-native uh, platform, it only deal with the first form. So you'll see the Arabic language all broken into non-readable thing mess. Because it's supposed to have a different form, depends on its position of the word. That's why I made my own system, which 
try to figure out what letter it is and what's the condition of the letter. Is it connected before or is it connected after or is it connected in both shapes and assign it a value. So now we have the order of the values and we need to print them one by one. So it should be from one to something in here. Every 20, we need to uh, jump one letter. So in other words, we need to draw a box. Not a string. So let's give it a try. And the image should be... Oh, in a minute, I didn't load it in the system. In the game core file. Hmm. Um. Uh, let's go to the game initialize. Or even the test game, I don't know where to put that. Give me a second. Give me a second. Come on, open please. I'm begging you. Thank you. So we need to um, load the sucker somehow. Should that be part of the engine? I'm not sure. It should be maybe. If I need to add it as part of the engine, I should add the data in here to load it with the other images. Like in here, you'll see I have all the images loaded in here. Uh, but for now, let, let me make mm, some silly work. Some just simple work. I kind of forgot how to load the thing. So let's go to the game core. I need to upload it to the texture dictionary. And it should be in the content load, I believe. Initialize load content so test game file um, texture dictionary add Um, Arabic alpha, I believe it's written. Arabic alpha with a space. A new texture. Oh, come on, don't screw with me. Yeah, I kind of forgot. I really forgot. Um, initialize content. Let's go. So I need to send the content, the whole thing. Jesus Christ. Oh, I need to use texture load or content load. Okay. Okay. So I don't need to use the constructor immediately. And then I need to call the name. Yeah. Folder name. What's the folder name? All right, all right, so we need the bath, in other words. Uh, fonts. Um. 
Um, let's see how many caches we have before we do anything. Yep, figured. Um, oh, give me a break. Empty statement. All right, no caches. Now let's try again. So here we need to do um, uh, game core, CGC, texture dictionary, Arabic, alpha. Uh, distance rectangle is based on Oh boy. Um, hmm. Oh boy. We actually have a list of integers. Oh, an hour pass. Whatever. I'm not taking a break. Screw it. Let's do another 30 minutes. Um, we need to make a list of integers and use share function to get these integers. So, actually, we need to do a loop here. So, um, yeah, it will be n square, definitely. All, big O of n square. So, in the draw function, let's do int Arabic encryption values. Integers? Uh, do you know what screw you? Um, before we do any kind of printing, let's use our friend, the share function, and give this guy a list of integer values based on the text. Uh, share function. token int list c value uh, g caption I believe come on what's wrong now there is no argument da 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 oh I hate you oh I hate you so we need um, a reference number to remember where we are we and I need a symbol for the token and a symbol for when the string will end. So here we send the reference of K and the symbol for the tokenizer is the space but this one is a problem we need to use something so unused that we shouldn't stumble upon it like a unicode value like uh, U00BB What now? I hate you. Actually, I shouldn't initialize it in the first place. So we have the list of the numbers now. Now we need to do a loop. And 
and based on this loop we can get a new rectangle of a position of so if we um, get zero it's zero if we get one then it is one multiplied by the size which is 10 so um, one not one uh, a e v i multiplied by 10 all divided over 20 not 20 because you see if it is 20 we should go zero again in the x position that's mean modded maybe I should mod the AVE itself not the position so like this letter should be um, 40 so it is zero again so uh, the AV itself is modded and multiplied by 10 and the Y is divided let me see so this one is 0 1 2 3 and this is 23 and the Y just jumped down by 11 so it is divided by I believe I V I and all multiply by 11 and then 10 11 I love you not really um, Then what's the third value? The color? Alright! <laughs> Let's give it a try. How many crashes we will get? And first crash! Oh, because the input and the fly thing is this one is not Arabic so what we are going to do is we're going to replace it with the this letter 20 20 20 20 20 20 20 20, 20, 20. crash again um <sighs> index was outside the fucking array so we got 120 and then we add the i Can I? No, because I need the um, the the courage return. Uh, we we need to return the result if we are full as well. So how to do that? If S I, which is two, and S. And I two. Uh, one two. Can I know the length? Is the length two? I believe. If is length. 
is less or equal than I return result wait 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 I'm having a headache now why am I incrementing I when I return the result let's take a look oh yeah I, I, I need to return that yeah yeah because I might use the same uh, yeah yeah okay okay because I might use the same string to get more values like loading a file okay 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 um, but here it end the file so it doesn't matter okay okay let's see the new crash that's our life crashing fucking crashing what now all right hmm it ended with space Fifty-four, fifty-six, thirty-six. Thirty-four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Seventeen multiplied by three. Forty-six. Oh, not the uh, oh uh, no, it is, it is, it is, it is. I wish if there is a way to see where is exactly thirty six in here. And it's saying to, uh, trying to, so the result is zero. Who called you? Yeah, l we need to return the stack that we closed. I shouldn't close that thing. I was a little bit angry. And now I don't know where the stack. But it should be one of these guys. I don't think it's a notification. Error list? No, I already have it. Um, calm down. Task list? I don't think task list. Stack call or something should be so. Solution explorer? No. Maybe call hierarchy? Can you tell I'm tired? Yeah. I can't even think. Nope.
I hate this shit. I hate this shit. I hate this shit. Okay. One million thing to 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 view. I will search for it, I don't care. Because I need to know who called him. Let me close this one. I should take a break when I had a chance. Uh, visual Studio. How to sh view or show or bring up uh, the um, error stack. Does it call error stack? Call stack. Oh, it's from the debug menu? Really? Not from the view? Well, what did he say? Call stack. I don't see it. Jesus, GB of friends. Interesting. Maybe when I deal with my timer system, I need to check what the hell is this. Hello. Welcome back. Can you go to the back where we used to be? Come on. You used to be not in here, but in the middle. Can you, please? Thank you. Finally. So we are in here. And then we are in here. What I was doing? <laughs> I forgot. And the uh, caption is this. And uh, oh, silly me. I didn't zero the key. The reference key. Okay, 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 okay. After I finish the loop, um, yeah, I should do that. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. We need to do a lot of crap. First of all, we need to add the position of the GUI itself. So, let's. Second of all, why? What's going on? So, um, here we add plus C value RX or GR. But wait, this is the location of the destination. Oh, oh yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, we need another rectangle. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. So we have uh, destination, position, destination source. All right. So uh, 
this should be um, the position of the GUI itself. plus the position of the letter multiply the size of the letter plus some extra space uh, for the beginning of the letter here is the same thing which is y 11 and here we need the size of the letter and let's test it again and let's start to become thirsty i need to make some tea oh boy so the letter is correct aleph but there are many things wrong in here uh first of all <laughs> Oh god. Um printing the letters from the left to the right and the Arabic should be typed on the right to the left. Second of all we are jumping but actually the order of the alphabet is correct. Al Kharuj Min al which mean exit from the game. I need to show this to my uh to my uh To the guys that they need, they need to do the art. So how about this? I'll make some tea. I'll take a break for ten minutes. I'll use the bathroom. I'll call the guys and try to show them this work. Good, good. So because it's funny to see the mess that programmers need to deal with before they get everything correct so first i will call them oh, no let me use the bathroom and make some tea first but before that let's do uh drag this one here do the be right back and do 10 minutes actually i'll take more i'll use the bathroom and everything so I'll see you in the
So someone is asking something I don't know what the hell. And I don't know if he left or not. MOOC courses deliver honor code certificates. Um, I don't know. Uh, is it what do you call it in English? In Arabic called Mu'taraf uh, biha. Do people accept it? Uh, do they recognize the certificate? If not, then I don't know if you care about it or not. Y you should call them and call their support if they have support. Um, let me call the guys. I'll let them know that I'm on Live Code TV. And I will like I will keep the big right back on. Oh, okay, let's remove it uh, because I'm still on the break. Ten minutes left. Uh, live code. Let me get the address. Halian, I forgot how to speak in Arabic. Don't screw with me. Alright. So we send the email, I'll lower the email, one minute left, so let's start it. And they might, oh, 60 minutes, not 10 minutes. And uh, they might, I might need to call them on. So the, these guys are drawing me a new alpha tech set, uh, not pixelated. I have no clue how to do that. And uh, they are not sure what the hell am I asking them to do. And they already made a set for me, but it wasn't, uh, the sizes were screwed up. So here, these are the guys, let me message them. sure if I can pop up uh, the chat alone from Facebook maybe not but anyway anyway uh, so let's try to fix uh, the position at least the Y position I'm not worried about the word we're up yet so what's going on in the Y position
we are multiplying the i without dividing it the position no wait uh, why are we multiplying the y we don't need to multiply the y do we i mean it's the same position plus three um all right all right all right so and we need to multiply the y if we need we we have a new line what have ah uh, calm down calm down you don't want to get angry you don't want to get angry so let's try the arabic again and there you go jadida but it's um reversed so we need to reverse the order so what we are going to do we are going to add the component width not the x actually plus the x so here plus width plus actually minus minus there you go there you go so um One problem we have is why it's not here. Oh, minus the, um, let's make it minus 13 because the size of the letter is 10 and you know how the programming X begins from the left position. There you go. Actually three is a little bit not good for the buttons. So maybe let's make it seven. All right, so we have few things that we need to deal with. We need to do word wrap and we need to do um, new line. We need to deal with the new line. How can we deal with the new line? This is the problem. Okay. Okay. So Ben Jones say okay. And I say uh, okay. Oh, I forgot to fix the filter for the microphone. I don't know if it do any difference. So okay. Another thing that I need to do, but I will do it later. I need to print the letters in Arabic when I do a drag to the menu. Uh, when I do the drag, I do the default thing. I didn't change that code yet. So if I change into Arabic and drag, it show me the values of the encryption, which actually good for testing for now. So the first letter, Lam, is 114 so if we go to uh, 114 20 40 60 80 100 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 and that's the correct letter so you see, the English letters are way clearer than the Arabic one, and that's why I ask these guys to, to 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 help me to make a better font. So let's make a dialogue that hold the text and te test the text were up. But before that, uh, let's go to the other program, run it. 
I don't know when they will send me an email to reply on my crap. Edit the game. No, not edit. Uh, we cannot edit the dialogue from here. I need to load the campaign, load the map, load the script, put the game in here. And let's make a new key and let's call it um, new line test. And in English, let's say this is two sentences line. This is, doesn't make sense. This is a two lines, one sentence. I don't know what I'm saying. And let's switch to Arabic. Hadihi Jumla Fi Safarain. Save. Move the file. This is the old game or the new game? No, this is the new game. And we will try to add it somewhere. Uh, to be honest, I forgot how to add a component that holds more than one line. I'm not sure which one is it. Uh, even though I'm... I want to check something. The frame MC. Yeah, I, I know. Actually, I should add the... Uh, the warning this is very boring because dealing with dialogue and text and text for app and it's not ppp not fire not laser no, no explosion no death animation uh, even though the game is working behind the scene but i'm focusing on this part now if you came a week ago you will see me testing uh, the, the the weapon and firing gob and death and crap but not today. And if you have an animation here on it, uh, like if I press enter, and he dies and fall and disappear. But we are testing uh, crap like this. Text box and stuff. So uh, unlucky you, you came in the wrong day. Actually, my work is always boring, so don't worry. <laughs> Uh, so here text were up. Who called the text were up? I forgot. I completely forgot. It should be in. Oh, this is a helper function. Okay, default text for wrapper. Okay, okay. Uh, I, I, all of these things I done them two years ago and as you can see no comments so I deserve it I deserve it where's my tea let me play with the tea tag Drag a lease, click, rise flag, default text wrapper. Holy tomato. Are you kidding me? I should made it into um a dialogue and I said sorry into a delegate and it said a static function no one called the sucker holy cow then who wow really I'm sure I made dicks for up definitely sure Um, GK. 
caption. This is the wrong thing. I don't know. I really don't know. So we receive the main menu in here. And I'm totally confused. Because I remember I tested the, the text wrapper. And it was working with English. But I don't see anyone who's calling this function or this function. It should be called in here. Oh. It's called in the menu component uh, constructor. I see. And this one's supposed to be polymorphize, polymorphism, I believe. No. Holy tomato. Really? That's it? Oh, okay. So it is polymorphism. If it's not implemented, then he do is printable. So when we go, uh, thanks God I have this one, I might get more confused. So say G caption and it add two lines, why is that? I have no clue why I'm doing this. Then it called the default, which is here. Oh yeah, it's take the width. It takes the width off. Okay. So in the frame MC, the width of this guy is The width that we assigned it to them. Okay, 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 okay. Where is it? Funny, you're still here, all of you. So it is here. Then why I only see one word? Why is that? So you see here, it says main. That's it. No menu. First of all, let me remove all of these. Not completely remove, but. Yeah, I'm planning later on, I make templates that hold the whole window and it add all the GUIs automatically and give the names dynamic, name calling and everything. Na name generation. I should use the correct concepts so this one should be the main menu frame so if I go to the data main menu and here the width is 400 and yet I was not sure why did he not assign the whole thing so the size is 365 then he should work, uh, take each word and check and crap and sp is main only what the hell so something went wrong in here 
Don't you love trying to debug a code that you made two years ago? So let me check the email. Nope, didn't answer. So I need to go through this crap slowly. And to be honest, I'm not in the mood to fix this. Let me be honest. Actually, I'm not in the mood to the code, but I need to do something today. I need to do some work. Because we, uh, there must be, <laughs> uh, the priority list must have zero before it have one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh wow, now it doesn't even have menu. Let me try add a component that have a dialogue for the God's sake. This one have frames and I don't know what's about it. Uh, let me see what do I have. <sighs> this one's supposed to be um, dialogue that you can pick the choices from. But I need a label. I need to make a label. Let's try to make a label. Oh, what should I call it? Um, I don't know. I just call it label. So let's try to make a new menu component template. It should behave similar to the button a little bit. So we need to use my string separator, my parser, my script language. I didn't do anything and he's already crying. He's already crying. Actually copy everything, I'm a lazy bastard. Alright, the thing is... We are going to add a label MC and let's call it LMC. assign the mouse click on it and we send the script in here all right 
right, so let's let's try this one. So and the test game we want to add a label and here below these guys and let's make this guy a little bit taller I don't want to add it in the main menu actually we will make the main menu smaller so let's do that so the main menu let's make it into size 200 now let's make it as big as before 180 and add, make this one taller 350 and add a label Why, why, you, why, 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 why? Uh, label one. And let's give it a dialog that we just add in the game file. Yeah, I forgot to close this one. I shouldn't close it. Dialog game. And it's called new line test. Did I copy the file? I don't know if I copied the file. But let's copy the file. This is from the map simulator to the game. And let's make the dialogue called. I should send a string instead of sending this. And in there it should assign the, the dictionary new line test and it's called label one and it's belong to the first group and its position is 200 and no 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 position is 20 150 I love you crying. Are you done? Fucking bubbler class. <sighs> uh, is it visible to and uh, no script? Well, let's take a look. Crash. Jesus Christ. I forgot to change the GUI. Uh, and apparently the GUI name was wrong. Oh, there is no L1, silly you. Uh, great. Another crash. So here you see this is two line sentence. So as you can see it's memorized a new line crab in the English one. In the Arabic one it doesn't but why the position is wrong? Uh, not wrong but it seems I need to add more space. This one is I believe 75 in size or something. So let's make this one 170. Of course, I need to restart the thing. 70. And why it's not gray? And there is no gray background? Hmm. I don't know. So let's switch into Arabic. Jesus Christ. Uh, it started in the wrong place. It's the right one, but it didn't determine or so the, the new line thing. And I gave the new line a symbol 187, I believe. 186. So, first of all, why it's not printing on the right? Let's fix this problem first. It's begin at here. But what's the size? Do we have a size? Hmm. 
why I don't have a size so we need to add a size to the label so if we go to the frame we see we have a width and height but it's called the base with the width and height okay 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 in the label we copy the button and the button didn't send width and height so let's do int width and height and we send here width and height so I made them optional apparently with negative one so we need to add here with uh, with height with height with height with height and in here we add the height let's say three lines three lines multiplied by 12 36 maybe well actually let's take 350 minus 170 which is um, 180 80 so let's say 70 ah sorry 170 Uh, to 60 all right that's why I didn't print the gray color so I see now it's this gray uh, it should start from 20 and oh my god spline it's it's going to give me a color blind so white and uh, let's make it start from 60 now this way to in the front 40 I thought it would come first you know, I should have a cold drink instead of tea all right that's much better uh, but I don't know where's the position now because both of them are white congratulations well if I move it because I know how my systems work it gives partial transparency you can see so we need to decrease it by another uh, 20. There you go. So if we switch into Arabic, this one should be in two lines, just like the ones in here. So if we switch one, this one into Arabic, you see the sentence in two lines. But in the game, it's in one line because the I didn't program it yet. So what we are going to do, what we are going to do, is we go into the mini component, add a counter for the lines somewhere. Man, this will be a nightmare because we need to do the text wrapper list next but we will we will see we will see we will see so here we will check if it is arabic and we need to make a condition here we need to make a condition here so what we are going to do what we are going to do first of all let's make a counter let's add it in, uh, on the top um wait every text box should have its own value wait 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 uh, or we make it locally inside the draw we could actually make this one part of the dialogue what's the captain language does the engine support by the way it's the SSI, and you, if you ask what, I will say SSI, and if you say what, 
I'll say, well, it's expected. It's my own secret language, actually. I made the parser by myself. This guy. Uh, I made it in 2010. I gained tons of experience and I see it crappy now and I don't like it. Yeah, 2000, sorry, 2011, the last change, last update, version 6, 1.016, so, yeah. Uh, I could make it called C Sharp Interpreter, but screw that, screw that. I wanted to do my own thing, this is my own engine, my own thing. Uh, it's... I will work on it later and here <laughs> uh, after a month two three four after like five or six months <laughs> if things goes according to the deadlines but yeah because the whole thing uh, needs a lot of polishing. But yeah, I'm glad you're asking. Actually, it's doing stuff. I can type a code and create new characters. And then write another line and let the controller control that character. Add maps, load maps, delete maps, add creatures, add bullets. Stuff like that. My plan was is uh, to give me the control like the GMs in video games. In the runtime. Including generating a new dungeon. A randomized dungeon on the fly. Stuff like that. So I just say on the script. Generate dungeon with the number of floors and the level of difficulties and the rate of treasures. And it just generate that. That was my dream. Seven or eight years ago. But oh well. So I'm. Um, got busy with the school. Got busy with the. With the university. For the second and the third time of my life. Tried to get jobs. And now I'm working on my. Foolish dream. Once again I guess. So yeah. Yeah. Good time. Good time. So what I was saying, I was saying, I could move this part into the dialogue itself, so instead the guy who throwing the things to the calculation, maybe it's smarter to make each dialogue have its own values, but actually calculation gets reset every time I draw, so screw it, screw it, screw it, as long as it works now, I'm happy with it. Optimization, we can leave it later. And dialogue optimization, seriously? We should care about them other things. Unless if the thing became bottom, bottleneck for some reason. So, what I was saying. So, let's make... Arabic. New line. Counter. Arabic new line counter is equal to oh wait is equal to unlock Arabic new lines counter so in here if AEV Excuse me. If is equal one a six, I believe I can go to the code to the other guy and check. Where is that thing? Here, 186. Wait. Mm, 
No, this is no, 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 no. Um, this is here. Oh, I don't want to paste. Okay, okay, okay. I cannot make the thing here. Check for new lines. Um. What I was going to do. <laughs> uh, sorry about that. Yeah, Arabic new line counter. Plus plus. Uh, do I need to ignore the letter? Yeah, I need to ignore the letter. So continue. And in here, we need to jump it by the Arabic new line letter. new line counter sorry i mean multiply by the size of the font for now let's say it is um 12. it's actually 11 but plus a space uh let's make it two pixel space so let's take a look oh we didn't made a reset to the to the rest of the text now how can i make a reset to this calculation Now that's a little bit tricky because we are depending on the position of I. Let me do something else because we might be able to solve this problem, solve two problems with one stone by applying the word wrap instead of applying later. So what we are going to do we are going to make a new one and let's call it text wrap test and add a very long passage. Let's take it from the news. Who are these people? First order news in Saudi Arabia, I don't care. Home, BBC News. Saudi, Saudi, Saudi. I don't care about Saudi. Even though I'm from there. Trump. Let's see Trump. So let's drag all the stacks. Let's go to Google Translate. Add the text in here. Jesus Christ. Let's see if the system handle it. That's the test purpose in the first place. And go to the Arabic side. And add. Oh God. Donald Trump. Oh God. It's funny to read some stuff in Arabic sometimes. Uh, it doesn't feel like the, the formal Arabic. It feels a little bit off sometimes. Save. So this is text or app test. Close. And we go to the game. And we will replace the test in here. And we need to move that file. Uh, Uh, 
And let's test it. Not you. You. So you see. Let's try to apply the text war up on this guy. If it's possible. So text label Let's go to the dialogues I don't know why I added a line maybe two no two lines Maybe to make the caption inside the box, I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe I can fly, I believe I can die, actually, I, of course I can. So let's give it a look. There you go. So this is what's called text for wrap, even though it's not perfect, it hopefully do the job. Let's turn it into Arabic and it crash. Oh, oh, no. So we need to make an exception. If it is an Arabic, we need to We need to do a solution for this. This is not going to work. This is not going to be easy at all. Six thousand eight hundred. What are you talking about? Oh wow! Is it done long? Only tomato. Let me take a breather because I can't even think now. You can see how the thing is becoming a little bit serious. Uh, do you know what? Let's test the, the two new line first. Uh, and make the exception in there. How do I change it? Uh, new line test. I didn't do anything. I'm tired. I'm really tired. What's wrong with you? Oh, it says it's outside of Foundry, whatever. Don't tell me it doesn't accept r slash r slash n or whatever. Or maybe it doesn't count slash r slash n. But I'm already avoiding them, I guess. Yeah, I'm avoiding them. This is ridiculous. This is fucking ridiculous. Um,
So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, exactly. So, did I trim it? I don't think I trimmed it. Is he, con does he consider slash R slash N as one letter? I don't think so either. Do I need to check if the last letter is empty? Ah. What does continue do? Let's go through the loop. What if I add one here? No, decrease it by one. Thank you. Oh, I see what's going on. This is even in a new development. <sighs> he considered the whole sentence is going out of his position. You see what's going on? This is supposed to be two lines. But because if you put this sentence in one line, it will go out of the box so he moved the new word sentence the last word into a new line jesus christ why so we need to reset the counter if we uh, meet the word new how to reset the counter this is for the english part of course the arabic part need a lot more fiascos. So who how wow. Of shark sufficients. So we the small letter we consider it size six, and this is ten. So this is the temp count. So I believe we need to zero the temp count. Okay. Let's give it a try. Let's give it a try. There you go. So at least we found a problem and we solve it. And actually, I should tell, tap down, uh, type ta ta ta. I should type down all the things I done, so I can brag to myself and celebrate every time I done something. But I forgot what I did today the whole time. Damn, already three hours and I forgot what I was doing. Well...
Well, I'm still working on this. Actually, kind of done the Arabic one. I uh, took the encrypt and changed it to Arabic, but I didn't print it based on the size. And the uh, word were up, actually, we just fixed, fixed the new line issue with the word were up. Made a label come menu component. Made new lines in the dialog printed in both English and Arabic. Main menu component accept an array of string to create a dialogue on the fly or take a dialogue key. Make the menu component Take only the key of the dialog and add it menu and instead of sending the dialog reference from the game file. So I need to do that. Uh, let's try to do the word we're grabbing Arabic. So once again, the new line and the word wrap are not working correctly. We need to implement that. So the new line need to zero the position of the Y or the X I mean. So in other words, we need to add the variables to where The position of X on the, of the, the line. So let me think. This is tiresome. This is truly tiresome. So this is the position of the letter. And as you know, the letters are just a serial of numbers. So if I drag this guy, you will see the real code of the Arabic in here. These numbers. And the funny part, the, the funny part is text were up. Not perfect, but sticks were up. Uh, I have a headache. I need to focus. So we need to memorize somehow where's the position. So to do that, and instead of multiply this guy with i, we initialize the ax. And because we are already in the component, we give it the position here. Come on, don't screw with me. Here, Every time we uh, draw a letter, 
We increment the da 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 Now when we face a new line we should zero this guy. Let's take a look. Shit. What happened? something terrible wrong. What just happened? So decrease by 10, decrease by 20, decrease by 30. Why it's not working? Only when it finds a new line, it should zero it. Why is not happy? Oh, silly you. Ta -da! So when we receive a new line, we will jump to the new line. Thanks God. So this is how I edit the game. When I make a game. And this is the dialogue, and I need to say the dialogue in the main game. And this is the English one. And this is the Arabic one. And as you can see, the Arabic one should be right to left. So it should look like this. And this is how the English look like. So as you see, the game is similar. Except we have a problem here. Um... And the font for some reason went way too low for the buttons. I don't know why. Oh, I know why, I believe. I'll take a look on it in a second. So, this is how... It looks like this one, doesn't it? Uh, this font is much more beautiful because it's not my work. This is my own font I wrote by myself. So... I'm happy. I'm happy with the results. Uh, let me fix the button, then I will take a break. If I know where. Um, I don't know why it was way too low. Maybe... Maybe it's the Y thing. But this one should be zero. Let me remove this for a second. Oh, what have I done? I don't know why the buttons are look stupid now. Yeah. Um, for some reason, this started with a line, but this thing should be. Oh, I know why. This thing should be zeroed every time. And here. Uh, but this one is good reset it every time, so I shouldn't worry about. There you go. There you go. Yeah, I know the buttons doesn't fit the words, but we, we will we will we will deal with it. But after I do the text work up with the Arabic and English in here and take a break first before all of that.
So I, I'm so freaking tired. Wow, it's already 4 p.m. I was working at 11. Yeah, five hours. Five freaking hours. Oh well, be right back in 10 minutes.
Alright, I'm back. One minute to resume work. And then I can call it a day. I can call it a stupid freaking good for nothing. Where were we? Yes, font. Arabic font. Crap. We need to test the text for up after I finish my break in one minute. Can I have a break like six hours instead of working six hours and work ten minutes every hour of break? Yeah, I can, but my work won't <laughs> won't, won't be done even in a year. What am I talking about? In the century. Excuse me. So let's do it. Last hour. So let's load text work up test. And that's the English war app. So this is English war app because we are going out of our ways and we have a lot of lines. We get this result. Unfortunately, the calculation is not that perfect. So we can we could decrease the margin. Because the margin is 35, let's make it 15, and maybe we'll see better result. Ta da! That's still not good. Well, actually, it started to go out of the list, so maybe 35 was good. But I'm not sure why that the word Trump is not in the first line. And counter bar, maybe counter bar a little bit on the edge, so we'll jump it here. Undisclosed, a little bit tall, so it's but here the word uh, in here it start to go out of the line easily. Mm, maybe because my calculation sucks. So anyhow. We need to test it in the Arabic one. So actually, let's see how it behaves before we um, do anything. So it's using the normal lines. Um, but it doesn't do a wrap. Uh, it's a little bit tricky because as you can see, We don't have lines or spaces in the Arabic. So let's try to do it. So this is the condition for the Arabic. The easiest way to do it is just to make a complete condition for the Arabic ones. Um, and in the Arabic we have fixed size, we don't have 6 and 10. What the hell is this?
Alright. Do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? Um... Ta da! Alright, let me think. I haven't added text size yet. I might need to do that. Actually, we already done this. We need add Arabic. I even all fonts actually. Um, So make a menu component take only ticket and no, 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 later 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 even though this is a very easy one but I don't care difficulty is like two this one needs some freaking thinking So let's pass each letter. If I don't know why this condition exists. It says if there's no letters at all and there's a new line, no, there's a catch return or empty line, ignore it. Okay. So let's make a similar condition. But there's no slash R, so let's remove it. And there is no empty space. The empty space is 11. Oh, wait. Oh, God. Uh. We, we we don't need to check the uh, the string. We need to check the values. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Oh wait, it was co up. I can show you. I can show you. Mm. So we need to uh, make this guy. A E V again. Let's make this code great again, as Donald Trump suggest, suggest, claim, claim, propose. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit tired. So let's craft this and here. We uh, in Arabic assign this value and we uh, only need the K and we already know the component so we don't need the value from the priority list 
So we convert it into um, a list of integers, the decrypted code, the encrypted code. What's wrong with me? And then we check if the AEV, the Arabic encrypted values, is equal space, which in our case is 11. If it is a new line, then 186. Um, uh, then we uh, count with this font size, which is 10. Replace it with the font size later. And then we check if we got the space, which once again, it's 11. Then we check if we hit the edge of the component. And if we do, we uh, add a new line. If not, we just add a line. So let's replace the code slowly. <clears throat> so this one is this one. And this one is this one. And this one is this one. And this one is, so we don't need the TK in here. Oh wait, this is, this will, uh, will take all the whole word. Mm. I cannot take the whole word in this case. So let me put it like this. So this one increase tens for each letter we add and we take the midpoint of the first word and the second word for some reason I have no clue what I was doing in here. Completely no clue. Alright, alright, alright. So if we find a space.
we keep adding all the letters but in our case all the letters are fixed size And this one add the word. I see what's going on. So we check if the next word should be add immediately or add a line before it. So we keep the word till he add it to the right time. Oh, he's still here. Watching my misery. Not stuck, but uh, I need to think a little bit because dealing with the English is different dealing with the language that I just invented, the Arabic one. I didn't invent the Arabic one, I mean I invented this font and how it behaves. So it's a little bit annoying, a little bit annoying. Because I'm dealing with numbers in here, I'm not dealing with a real font actually. Each number represent a letter or a space or whatever. So I need to know all the numbers before the space. What bothers me is he add all these numbers. Okay, okay, we can do it, we can do it, we can do it. So what we are going to do is we are going to use this T and he defined it here we are actually going to define it outside so here while I'm counting no outside outside actually turn it into a string builder too So what we are going to do, if it is a space or not, we don't care, we don't give a fuck, and we are going to amend the number, uh, wait, 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 amend the number and a space. And last if it is 11, if it is 11, then we add this one to a string and then we clear it let's take a look let's take a look let's take a look this is the english one this is the crash i mean the arabic one Did I clear it after I finish? Nope. Um, where do I need to clear this sucker? Oh, wait. Hmm. Why is not happy? Um, ok, 
is equal to zero. K is equal to zero. Why it's not zero? <sighs> Do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? Let's clear it before. Turn it into Arabic and it's cash in the same position. I have a headache. Oh, okay. So this is the uh, long message. Oh wow, it disappeared. No, it starts with wow, it doesn't start with a. Eh. What's going on? 20 is Aleph. Uh, for, okay, th this letter. Uh, something is wacky. Something is going on wrong. Label 1. K is equal to 0, but this guy is. Oh, wait. Don't tell me it hit the symbol already. And I have a headache. For some reason, the string is... Oh, not empty. This one is empty. One of these fucking bugs that you have no clue what the hell is going on. Is it the curse of eternal crap? So I'm getting tired of this shit. I'm really getting tired of this shit. So this one has twenty. Who called you, Mr Anderson? Who are you? Who am I? <sighs> What's the ID? I have no clue what's the problem, so I will keep randomly stumble around till I find it, right? It's in the choices, okay. 
So the, the synthesis, this is the first choice, and it worked fine. When I click on E, this one found 2,000 letter and spaces. And this one is from label one, which is fucking fine, it seems. But the second one, is from an empty caption. So we have um, label, wait. Are you accessing a null thing? No, there is one. It has empty caption. Alright. And this guy is not fucking empty. Can you run now, please, before I lose my patience? Yeah, this is how I talk when when my stress level get a little bit freaking high. He fucking fucking fail again. One twenty eight. Who? What is one twenty eight? One twenty eight is twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one hundred, one twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Half a while. The first letter. So he reached to the fifth letter which is an empty fucking space and we should check for an empty fucking space which is correct no wait 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 no it should be 11 no Oh, now I have a headache. Um, no, it's there. Uh, yeah, yeah, it should be an empty space. So, why the sucker is empty? I cannot copy it, of course. Yeah, there's double space in here and it's killing it. It's killing it. I don't know why. 11 is a real space. Which is a little bit confusing because here, between the two, is a real empty space, which is 11. But here we have two spaces. Why? Um. <sighs> oh. 
Oh, maybe I know why. Maybe I know why. Let's go to the dialogue. Let's go. Hmm. Why did I add spaces in here? With 11, we shouldn't add double space because 11, we add space already. And with a new not line, we have a space already. Let's take a look. Nope. should copy the volume next time so yeah we have an issue here we have double space when we receive a space value which should be only 11 and I'm not sure why you notice every 11 there's double space after it hmm. did I screwed up something After every letter, I should add a space like this. And then I add a space in here. Depends on the number. Oh, wait, 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 and the space has already been add in here, wait, so we need to make a new file with new values, where is it? So let's remove this one. And let's remove this one. But it was working fine with the other sentences. That's what kills me about. So maybe I'll screw my code up because I'm not fully sure. There's one space here. Uh, all right. Let's save. I don't know. I don't know. Let's save. I don't think this will solve anything. So, oh wow, now there's no spaces at all. I feared that. I feared that. What have you done? What have you done, my friend? You screwed up everything. You screwed up everything. Uh, 
I believe the file will be corrupted. Yep. We corrupted the file. <sighs> we corrupted the file. It wasn't a problem, but I was hasty. Oh, no, this is not the encrypted one. This won't work either. This won't work either. Yeah. Yeah. This is with the Arabic, not encrypted. Um, if you don't mind, let me censor something and edit the file manually and remove the whole thing I know it is sad where is it? goodbye now let's go back and make new text boxes So we have our text boxes in here. And actually, I don't need these suckers. Say to me. Um, but for testing purposes, we can have them. Because these ones, actually, we... Uh, made uh, the dialogues on the fly or we could do the dialogues on the fly instead of calling them like this but to make our life easier we could always use this system if it's working to um, use the Arabic encryptor and decryptor instead of putting it on the fly as the values and numbers and that's why I need to add a box in here to show me the numbers so I can copy them and paste them in there if I wanna do that so let me do that options uh, exit and let's do the Arabic one First of all, let me change the languages into two, so we don't have Russian. And let's add a text, a text, a text, text, text. And this one will have some new lines and some crap. So let's take it from the internet. And let's do I don't know any page ah. Ah. and we put it in the English here and the Arabic we translated <laughs> we didn't get to the Arabic in the formal way. 
السرعة عقد من المرتزقة والسرعة واحد إلى جانب اللاعب. It's kind of funny. It's kind of funny. And save. And we go to the folder. And replace it. And in the game, in the label, we say text test. And let's try. On the fly. Oh. Main menu B1. Uh, did I put a question mark before it? Why is that? Uh, I made a mistake and I may I put an exclamation mark before it. I need to change that. So Arabic crash. The same problem. What if I, I remove this stupid thing? What if I make it a little bit simpler? Because I can't have no, uh, I can't even talk. I can't even fucking talk. I have no freaking clue what, what's wrong with it. Why there is an extra space? Why he's going up with me? Why? 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 Yeah, there's still an extra space. So let's copy the value. I can go and remove all the spaces in this case, but be be better to solve the problem from the uh, the root, uh, master root. Can I copy the value, please? Thank you. Where's the new folder? Remove the quotation. So here is a double space at line 25 at i24 we have a problem let's do this i can do this but i want to find a problem I'm not happy with this, but who cares if I'm happy or not? So we do the line work up is not working. First of all. Let's move the full thing. Second of all, let's go to I'm getting tired. Ah, 16 minutes left. 16 minutes left. Then I'll go and take a fucking nap. No, it's in the menu component here. Uh, the guy who's doing the, uh, the, 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 the this thing seems not working. Why? Wait a 
this second. Do you think this is the issue? Yeah, it was. It was the issue. Okay. Now we need to uh, figure out why didn't he stop at one at the end of the thing. Let me see. Uh, What's this? So This thing is not working um, for some reason. So, first word, second word, third word, fifth word, and we ended the line. Wait a second. Fucking silly you. Fucking silly you. I should add the new line in the encrypted language. There you go. There you go. Still not perfect, but the, as you can see, this word cannot fit in here. So it will wrap, but it doesn't look that beautiful because actually real programs, the way the websites and the font, when they go to the next word, they try to make the font a little bit longer in the middle to make the spaces look much more beautiful. Uh, so yeah, especially in Arabic because it has connected crap. But do you know what? I have enough work today. I have enough work today. So here we done this. So we done some work today. Good amount actually of work. Almost there. Doing the choices and everything. Thank you again for watching. This is the second time I stopped the stream. Unfortunately, these guys didn't answer me. I need to call them later. I'm tired. I won't go to work later. Tomorrow I'll make a video for them. And uh, I'll send them a message with the video link and everything. But for now... Uh, let me before I sign out brag a little bit because it is five hours and 50 minutes actually but I will make it six that's mean full time thank you for watching uh, see you next time